Ron joins us now to talk sports. I know we have game one of the NBA Finals over on WNEP, but you're starting with some softball. A championship weekend indeed, Lisa. Everybody pushing to make that state tournament. Rain cannot delay excellence. West Scranton and Pittston back on the field today at Marywood after a bad weather yesterday. Those two teams are going to be two of the best in the state, but only one is headed to the state tournament. The fans packing it around the stadium to see this classic softball game and the Lady Patriots pitcher did not disappoint. Gianna Adams was dealing nasty but necessary with the strikeout in the bottom of the second, keeping the game scoreless. But Mia Buka was like, I can do that too. In the fifth with two runners on, she gets out of the jam with the strikeout. So fast forward to the sixth, Bella Giardina is like, enough of this, no offense. There it is, there it goes, out to left field, runs at a premium in this game. and. West Piston takes a one to nothing lead, or Piston area, excuse me, takes a one nothing lead. And look at the pitching still. Adams in the circle getting it done with the no hitter. They get the final out thanks to Adams' no hitter. Piston area wins one to nothing over West Scranton. Incredible. The girls are, uh, both girls are just crazy competitors. Um, uh, fabulous, fabulous. Uh, West Scranton, Abington Heights. I mean, what, what a district. It, it's a shame we only get one. We're so proud to represent them. We knew West Scranton was a great team. We knew what they were capable of. But we also know what we are capable of. And we have confidence in that. And we have confidence in ourselves. And I'm just so proud of what we did and what we accomplished right here. We made history. And there's no better feeling than this in the world.